Okay guys, just some tips if you're having to stay at home. Now, I know it's really hard, but literally I have been used to this for about 21 years. One time I stayed in for two years because Molly slept all day, every day. Um, I think what you need to do is you just need to get up every morning do your hair, do your makeup, put your rings on, you know, make yourself look like you would be having a normal day, don't slouch around in your jammers, um, and get up and do stuff. And don't feel guilty if you don't do stuff, because to be fair, we're all very, very stressed all the time. Everybody is. And this this is the time when you can just relax a little bit and de-stress and everyone keeps saying to me well, what do I do I'm bored what do I do what do I do I mean Martin's just built an eight-foot planter I mean for Christ's sake it was only Saturday he wasn't even off of work then he is now he's out there again we're gonna have like a master garden by the time he goes back honestly but he's got ants in his pants so he needs to keep busy, but equally, don't feel guilty for having a rest, because that's what we all need to do. Don't feel bad for sitting down, watching the telly, putting your feet up, just be. You don't have to do things, just be, and just be happy. Um, it's a great time to play with the kids, you could do lots of things with the kids. I did the Joe Wicks workout yesterday, the PE lesson. Flaming hell. Honestly, I can't walk this morning. But, stuff like that. There's so many things now. I mean, I've been used to this for such a long time, so I've had to literally be my own entertainment. And, um, sometimes I'm not that entertaining. But I've literally had to keep Molly smiling for 21 years. We've all had to just keep happy. And sometimes, you know, we don't go out as a family because we don't want to leave Molly at home. So we're used to being at home and being together. And it's nice, you know, you can cook together. Just just do the garden, just do things, anything, anything. Just, just do stuff and don't worry about the situation because there's nothing you can do about it. And I've got two weeks now. I haven't slept for about a month now, but with Mel being allergic to her life-sustaining drugs and all that thing. And then um, all this, I haven't slept for about a month and I'm, I'm really knackered. But after two weeks, me and the kids and Martin are going to have the massivest party because in two weeks' time we'll be safe and we'll know that Mel's going to be okay. So just chill out, everyone. Take a break, have a rest. And while this is all going on, everything out there is just, it's just going to get better because there's no pollution happening. There's no, no craziness going on. Everything is just taking a chill pill. And we have to do this. We've got to do this for all the people that wouldn't get through this thing. And there are a lot of people out there. So just do what they say stay home and honestly message me if you need something to do I'm the master of making something out of nothing literally 21 years in isolation I know what I'm doing you take care I'll see you all soon hopefully